stay, my little teacups. Would you like to join me for an adventure in Undertale? Yes, I am your host, the Over Englishman. Now, you might wonder why I'm walking in circles around this mushroomy room. Well, apparently, as I've heard, if you do this enough, then eventually a very, very special thing will happen. I have no idea exactly what it is. So I'm not sure if I'm going to know when it's happened or not. But I will try. And I'm going to try this for a little bit. And I'm going to speed it up until I get there. And then if nothing happens in the next five minutes, I'll cut it out. But let's find out, shall we, audience? Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, I have been trolled. I'm going to leave. Uh, I can't believe I fell for it. So sorry for wasting your time, dear audience. However, I do have a little bit of a present for you all. Something that some of you brought up in the comments section and I realized I'd completely forgotten to do. As a certain chap, certain bony little fellow who we stood up recently. He, we asked him on a date, and then we didn't go. So now, here we are again. So you came back to have a date with me? Absolutely, Papyrus, my friend. You must really be serious yes. about this. Yes, I am. I'll have to take you someplace really special. Mm -hmm. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Yes, home? Grillbees, by any chance? Pardon that noise. My house. I knew it. Oh, Papyrus, you are bloody adorable. I also like how... Why is that room on fire? I also like how we walked all the way like across town and then back again to just look like we were going somewhere else. What's this? Can I click it? This is my brother's pet rock. Oh. He always forgets to feed it. What's he feed it? As usual, I have to take responsibility. Okay. The rock is covered in sprinkles. Aww. Ah, kitchen. Lovely. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. I'm not going inside just yet, Papyrus. Mainly because I want to see why the hell this room is on fire. The door is locked, is it? Right ho. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in yes. life. Always what's important, your bones. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yes! Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another... Qu <laughs> There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Yes, uh, I feel that's probably best. A joke quantum physics book is the most complex kind of quantum physical. Blah, 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 blah. What's this? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. <laughs> Sons, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. <laughs> Move it. <laughs> okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. I don't bring it back. Okay. It's... <laughs> it's still here. Don't you... Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. It's a sock with a serious person uh -huh. I'm having the time of my life. Aha! Uh -huh. Interested in my food museum? Please, 
the rules my culinary half, art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. On the subject of spaghetti, apparently in an earlier episode, I said that pasta and spaghetti are different things. You made spaghetti, not pasta. I have no idea why I'd be such a fool to do this, but as a lot of you point out in the comments, yes, they're the same thing. So, I'm terribly sorry about that. Uh, pasta and spaghetti, one and the same. My bad. Bin, as we all know from Pokemon, you've always checked the trash. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit at any time. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking oh something. It was like a quiche, what? but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd! Uh huh. And what is? Impressed, I increased the height of my sink. Why? Why is the sink on top of that? Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. Okay. That dog! What? Catch that meddling canine! I will! Curses! Damn it! <laughs> Sands! What? Sons. Stop plaguing my life with incidental music. <laughs> I have I have honestly never heard that phrase uttered in my life, but that sounds beautiful. Okay, anything left? Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. I won't, I won't, Papyrus. You... Oh, this is beautiful. You touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20G. Seriously? Jesus. I'm gonna touch the couch again. It's just a saggy old couch. Oh, bollocks. Well, I suppose there's nothing left to do but talk to Pappy. Welcome to Scenic My House. Scenic my ha- what? Enjoy and take your time. Thank you. I will. I've already enjoyed it, so I guess we go up to your room then, Papyrus, don't we? That's my room. If you I mean, personally, you've got a TV. I just want to chill and watch in Netflix, in. but... Do whatever people do when yes, they yes, date. we know. Go inside. Nice carpet, sir. Nice, I love it. And your bed that's a race car, oh. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Really? Great memories, huh? You kept them, oh, Papyrus, you're so thoughtful. Seems like it was only yesterday. It was only yesterday, you bloody idiot. Even though it basically just happened. You have a computer. Computers exist in this world? I had no idea. Isn't that flag neato? Neato indeedo. Undyne found it at the bay. You really look up to Undyne, don't you? I think it's from the human Probably. world. Probably. Now I know what you're thinking. Mm-hmm. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. Please tell me your theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Oh, he's cracked the code, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> awesome. Action figures? Ah, yes. Action figures. Yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle <laughs> scenarios. Pardon me. How do I have so many? Uh, yes. Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. You got them for Christmas? Did you get them from Santa? Yeah, that's right. Santa! Ah! It's almost like he can actually hear my dialogue now. Well, you are pretty loud. 
Let's see. Um, bed. That's my bed. That's your bed. If I ever get to the surface, mm? I'd like to drive down a long highway. Oh. Wind in my hair. You don't have any. Sun on my skin. You don't have any. Of course, that's just a dream. Yes. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. Oh, papyrus. Stop being so bloody adorable. Books. I am going That book's one of my favorites. Sorry. I'm going to check every single bloody thing in this room, and if you don't like it, audience, well, you can lump it, because this game is beautiful, I tell you, beautiful. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. Of course. Of course it's one of your favorites. That next book's another one of my favorites. Mm Mm-hmm. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. Oh. The ending always gets me. The ending always gets you, does it? Right, finally we got the PC. The internet. I'm quite popular there. How does he know this? I'm just a dozen away. Hmm? From a double-digit follower count. Aww. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. Oh no! Always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. Bad puns? You do realize you probably live with this troll, right? I mean, he plays the trumpet whenever you screw up. Lastly... There are no skeletons inside my closet. Are you sure the dog isn't in there? Well, except me, sometimes. Why would you go in the closet? Look in the closet, yes. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Huh. I was expecting the dog. Okay. So, um, if you've seen everything... Yes. Do you want to start the date? Yes. Begin the date. Okay. Dating start. Awesome. How do you date? Audience, I need help. Oh, what the... F- what the hell? Here we are, on our date. Uh, yes. Did this just turn into a visual novel? I've actually never done this before. Don't worry. I barely know what I'm doing either. But don't worry. I won't. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. Well, I guess you can't, but what relevance does that have? I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. (laughs) Fantastic. We're ready to have a great time. Yes, we are. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Step one, one. press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. Oh. Oh, oh my god, what? Wowie! I feel so informed. (laughs) Crime? What is crime doing that? Egg? Population? What? This is amazing. Also, I seem to be scanning for that dog from earlier. I think we're ready for step two. Yes, step two. Step two. Ask them on a date. Okay. Are you going to do it or am I going to do it? Human. I, the great papyrus. Right, okay. <laughs> will go on a date with you. No, 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 of course he, yes. Really? Oh, Maui. Oh, that kawaii is fuckface. <laughs> oh. I guess that means it's time for part three. Part three, yes. <clears throat> Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Right, okay then. Wait a second. Yes? Wear clothing. Hmm? That bandana around your head. I'm not wearing a bandana. You're wearing clothing right now. Yes? Not only that. What? Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. Yes? No! Could it be? Huh? Audience, I'm completely lost. Also, where is this bandana I keep hearing about? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes. No! 
Yes. You planned it all. Oh god, I think we've just blown his mind, ladies and gentlemen. You're way better at dating than I am. Thank you. No! Your dating power! Is over 9,000? No. Yeah. <laughs> Wait for it. Don't think you've bested me yet. What? I, the Great Papyrus... But you've been wearing clothes this entire time as well. ...have never been beaten at dating, and I never will. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? I can easily keep up with you. Fine, what's the tension meter about? You see, I too can wear clothing. I know! <laughs> In fact... <laughs> Sorry, I, I'm completely losing control here. I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Please do not show me your special clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Fair enough. <laughs> oh god. Behold! Yeah. Yeah. What do you <laughs> think of my secret style? What am I looking at right now? <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. <laughs> cool dude. What? What is it? Basketballs on your shoulders? <laughs> I love it. No. A genuine compliment. Yes. Genuine compliment. This power is increasing, yes! However... What? You don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Did I? What is the hidden power? Therefore... Mm hmm What you just said is invalid. Oh, okay then. This date won't escalate any further. Well, it already escalated quickly, as Ron Burgundy would say. Unless you find my secret. Your secret. But that mm -hmm. won't happen. There's no secret to my legs, just hard work and perseverance. Fair enough. Ah, uh, what about this? This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Ah. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. Fair point. I do it myself very, very regularly. I see, I see. What, what do you see? You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. Okay. But who doesn't? True. Uh, is it the hat? My hat? My hat? My mm -hmm. hat! <laughs> well then, you found my secret. What the hell? I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. I, I see that. A present just for you. Open it. Do you know what this is? Is that spaghetti? Spaghetti. Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Yes. Right. But oh so oh. wrong. Is it a brain? This ain't any plain old pasta. Oh great, the massive anime music's back. This is an artisan's work. Is it now? Silken spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask. Ah. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Of course, of course, Master Human, Chef. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is so indescribable. What a passionate expression. Yes. You must really love my cooking. Indeed. And by extension, me. Yes, Papyrus, you're so bloody funny. And I, I can't, I honestly can't believe that's how you choose to dress underneath that battle arm. I never would have guessed. Maybe even more than I do. I suppose so, maybe. Uh, uh, no. It's over 9,000! Human, it's clear yes. now. 
You're madly in love with okay. me. Everything you do, everything mm -hmm. you say, it's all been for yes. my sake. I'm determined that you'll survive this game. Human, I want you to be happy too. I am. You've, this whole episode has been funny as hell. It's time for me to express my feelings. Yes. It's time that I told you. Yes. I, Papyrus, I... Uh-huh. Um. Uh-huh. Boy, is it hot in here? Or uh -huh. is it just me? Oh, for God's sake, out with it. I know you don't love me. Oh, shoot. A human, I... Spit it up, man! I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. It's okay. It's fine. Uh, romantically, I mean. Mm-hmm. We could just be friends. It's all right. I mean, I tried very hard to. Yeah, I know you did. I saw. I thought that because you flirted with me... Yes? Uh, ...that I was supposed to go on a mm -hmm. date with you. Don't worry, man. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. Yes. It's okay. I would be able to match your passion for me. Mm-hmm. But alas, I, the Great Papyrus, been defeated? have failed. No, the Great Papyrus never fails. This was all part of your master plan, surely. I feel just the same as before. But, but, how could you do this to me? And instead, by dating you... What? I have only drawn you deeper... Papyrus. ...into your intense love for me. I thought we had something, Papyrus. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could you do this to me? How could I have done this to my dear friend? You oh, okay, sorry. I didn't realize you were going to... Is there an echo in here? No. Wait, that's wrong. What? I can't fail at anything. Uh, that's what I said. Glad to see we're back on the same wavelength again. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. Thank you. I'll keep being your cool friend. That's a good idea. And act like this all never happened. Indeed. But can we have the spaghetti, please? After all, I'm hungry as you fuck. are very great. Well, thank you. It would be tragic to lose Indeed. your friendship. Nobody should ever lose the over Englishman. So please. I am a pretty swinging hip dude. Don't cry because I won't kiss you. That's okay. No one was thinking about that. Because I don't even have lips. This is true. You don't. It would kind of be more like a headbutt. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Indeed. Well, no. Uh, but no, that's no, of not course true. not. Yes, aha. I have no idea what to say on this point. But I'll help you settle for second best. Indeed. <laughs> my friend. Oh, and if you ever need to reach mm -hmm. me, here is my phone number. Ah. You can call me anytime. Fantastic. Platonically. Yes. Well, gotta go. Indeed. <laughs> Bye -bye. And as Papyrus has to go, I believe so do I. Uh, can I have a nap in his bed? It's a race car bed. Neatly made. No, I can't. Okay. I'm going to get to the safe point. Papyrus's sons' room is still on fire. I'm going to go to the safe point. Save. And then end the episode for today, ladies and gentlemen. Here I am. I'm at the safe point. I don't know why I'm quite commentating this bit. At the sight of such a friendly town. da dee da dee da Save. Thank you very much for watching, my dear little teacups. And it has been quite an adventure today. Even though barely anything happened, I hope, I really hope, that you enjoyed this episode. Cue the end card, go! No, I'm not doing it. You do it. Dude, you have most totally got to do it. I just embarrassed myself in front of over a hundred people. I am not doing this. <laughs> Okay, bro, please stop pushing me. What's up, dudes? 
So, every Englishman has most historically forgotten to record his outro. So, so I guess you're stuck with me and my hilarious jokes. As usual, dudes, please do not forget to like the video, to comment on the video, to subscribe to the channel, and check out some of these most bodacious people listed below. Because, like a bone that is found in your leg, you will find them most humorous. Sans, stick to the script. Sorry, bro. Anyways, I'm going to Grillby's for a bit. Thanks for watching, dudes. See you around.